All right, so we're here today. Just a quick video, something I kind of figured out yesterday. Um, if you have multiple monitors, um, but they're different resolutions for whatever reason, like myself, uh, it can be hard to set a background without having to like stretch one to both or or whatever. But I figured out a way yesterday, kind of an ingenious way. Uh, if you take a print screen or a screenshot, it's right beside F12, and then you open up like video editing, not video, photo editing software. Uh, CS2 is free, because it is super old, um, so they released it for free a while ago, so it's kind of handy. Now this is kind of the resolution of both my monitors, because uh, I just did one of these. But anyways, if you paste the screenshot in here, it's either Control V, or you can probably do it there. No, you can't. Okay, Control V. Uh, so there is your current desktop, and you'll want to go uh, to get back to desktop. The shortcut is uh, Windows and D, and just like I find this dragging this in here works fine. Control A, Control C, Control V. Move it into place, and then da, 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 da. same thing. Control A, Control C. You can close it, and then Control V like that, and then just um, save as whatever you want. And then it should look like this. Or, well, when you have it set, uh, to set it, um, what am I looking for here? I think it's personalized. Uh, desktop background, you can set them. Set it to tile, and it will, otherwise it'll be all weird, like that. So yeah, tile, and then good to go. And then once you've set it, it'll look. Like this, this will be monitor one or whatever one's on the left, and then your one on the right, or whatever order you have them set in. Like if this one is actually over here or something, yeah. Anyway, just a quick video just to show that. I'll get that on my desktop because I don't need it. And I'll see you guys next time for more videos.